Mickey Kendall wasn't always the biggest fan of grocery shopping, but recently the author and mom of two has turned a routine hour into happy hour, indulging while she fills her cart. So normally when I go grocery shopping, it's sort of tedious. There's a lot of food. My kids eat a lot, so I have to get two carts worth of stuff. If I'm going to be here for an hour anyway, I might as well enjoy this hour. It's a growing trend with chains like Nordstrom, Whole Foods and Crate and Barrel offering customers the option to sip while they shop at some locations. Offering wine and beer at the store is one more way for retailers to get people in and to get them to spend more freely. One woman told me that she bought an entire crown roast of lamb um, and it ended up sitting in her freezer for six months because she got home, sobered up and realized she didn't know what to do with it. It's amazing what a good Riesling will make you buy. Sometimes I might end up in the fancy food aisle buying a little bit more prosciutto and fig preserves and maybe some extra fruit, some crackers that'll go with it. And it's not just alcohol. More and more retailers are offering experiences to draw customers offline and in store. Lululemon offers workout classes. Clothing retailer Alex Mill has tie-dye workshops. And Mickey's grocery store, Mariano's, even hosts live music. We're seeing pop-up stores, in-store climbing walls, knife sharpening sessions, I mean, cooking classes, anything you can think of, and retailers are trying it out.